right, let's turn back to Andy now. He's taking us out to wine. Yeah, country. I heard some about uh, 45 minute delays. If you're uh, taking a trimet or something like that, walk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Might be a lot faster to do that. Yeah, we're going to go to the wine country, Stoller Family Estate camera. Pretty cloudy skies, uh, but man, it's just gorgeous there, isn't it? Uh, 65 degrees, the current temperature that we have. And uh, winds coming in about six miles per hour. We head south uh, to the, the Willamette Valley vineyards and uh, also some overcast skies there but not stopping uh, people from sitting out on the little patio there and enjoying the beautiful view. It's uh, 68 degrees down there. It's winds coming in only about six miles per hour. Other temperatures uh, out along the coast, we're down to 55 in Newport, up to 64 in Tillamook. We have 70 PDX, not far behind Salem, 68, 66 Eugene, 68 Hood River. The Dow's up to 75, 58 degrees. Government Camp Central Oregon's in the low 70s. East of the casket or east side of the state, we're in the 60s, except for Pendleton. They're up to a nice 73 degrees. Hop up to Pasco, Washington, where it's currently 82 degrees. So uh, nice warm weather up there. So the forecast we have at the coast today, we will see skies become partly cloudy. Uh, pretty mild out there. High temperatures will be in the 60s. 61 Newport up to 64 degrees. And Tillamook, Astoria will go to 62. And in the valley, we will have the uh, partly cloudy skies developing as we get later in the afternoon. It's more of a mostly cloudy to hazy sunshine right now. Those clouds should break apart, giving us some sun through the uh, clouds there. 70 on the high for Kelso. We'll make it to 75 in Portland, up to 73 for Salem McMinnville. You'll go to 74. Now in the gorge, partly cloudy skies. We'll start to see those winds pick up as the day progresses out of the west. 10 to 15 could get gusts up to 25 miles per hour. Going to 73, won't them up all 72 Cascade Locks. The Dow's up to 78 today and Hood River going up to 75. Up at Mount Hood, uh, partly cloudy skies uh, with us this afternoon. Freezing levels going up to about 10,500 feet. 68th high Welches will go to 60 degrees at the pass. Up at Timberline, making it up to around uh, 54 degrees today. Now, central and eastern Oregon, a little bit interesting over there. Partly cloudy skies for central Oregon. 75 for Bend, 77 measures. Over to the east side, they had some pretty good rain earlier this morning. Could see some little pop-up uh, isolated thunderstorms uh, developing over there. So uh, be aware of that. 78 will be the high for Pendleton, 73 Legrand, 77 in Burns. Baker, you're going to go up to 75 degrees. So our seven-day forecast, it's uh, looking a little bit familiar with rain returning here for a while. Another atmospheric river potentially on its way. So today, partly cloudy, 75, 77 on Thursday, with the rain probably arriving into the late afternoon to early evening hours. And then a pretty rainy day expected for us on Friday. High temperature of 73 degrees. Saturday, more showers will be with us off and on through the day, going up to 71. So it could be a little bit of a soggy Grand Floral Parade if you're headed out that direction. And then Sunday, Monday, still a chance for some scattered showers. Temperatures cooler yet. Highs in the upper 60s. Normal high this time of year. It's about 73, 74 degrees. So uh, quite a bit below normal as we go through Sunday, Monday. By Tuesday, we should see a mostly dry day. Partly sunny skies and a high of 70. Lows throughout will be between uh, about 50 degrees and the low 60s. Kim?